All right, what's going on guys? It's Wild Year Sam here, and we're coming back with another Ark News video. And uh, here's, here's, here's what's going on. I made an Ark video about 10 minutes ago, right? I was about to upload it. And I got some new important information that y'all needed, needed to know. So I'm back here, gonna make another Ark video, just so I got, make sure all my infor information is correct. So here's what we got so far. This is this information is coming from Jake Clip, and I appreciate that. And like I said, we're we're out here on the back porch again. We're chilling. This is where I do my art news videos. But anyways, we have uh shoot, hold on. All right, Jimmy, the leader of Blackout, moved back to Server 48, and then uh, they got raided on Server 48 <laughs> offline, I think. Then Jimmy got exposed for trying to build a mesh base on Server 69. Then they got their blue orb wiped on server 266. 99 PFG and UWS is on server 50 right now. I think they have a couple fobs there. Not really sure. And that's PP on the Tweez last server and he's currently playing Destiny. So good for him. At least he can go out enjoying some Destiny. Blackout is leaving server 269. Server 270, Billy and the Boys may have been dev wiped. It's not totally confirmed yet, but uh, we believe it may have been dev wiped. 99 Meat ran most of the Lava Cave on Server 48. And uh, yeah, it's just 48 is not really going good for Jimmy. So hopefully it'll get better for him. Maybe he might. I don't know. I'm not sure what he's got planned. But on to some very important news. But real quick, I want to talk to you guys about relentless they got dev wiped um yeah relentless got dev wiped i think that's a is that a, that's an xbox or a ps4 tribe i'm pretty sure it's either ps4 i think it's ps4 but speaking of ps4 we have the tribe Knox. they were meshed on server 100 and uh, i'm not sure they they either no they meshed space cowboys on server 100 so yeah that's unfortunate feels bad but uh, on to the important part of this video you guys may have heard or something but there's like a little bit of I guess a conspiracy theory I don't know I don't know what you want to call it but let's just say John the boat Strix official PTF logic she's spicy and Brant 1030 were involved in an inside they incited someone right and uh it was a 21 year old girl they incited them but I don't, apparently some guy named Deshaun McGreer asked the female she he said this is an actual conversation on Facebook he said you still want your tribe back he asked the girl she said yes of course I mean who wouldn't want their base back he said if you'll send nudes you can have it back she basic he basically blackmailed her for her tribe back. I think it's nudes or $3,000. But the inside did happen. Uh, I, I'm talking to one of the people who did inside her, but he just wants his name cleared that he did not try and blackmail her for her tribe. And the people, the people who inside were John the Boat and Strix, those are the main people that I know of who inside. The rest of the people I didn't know besides like, I think Brant 1030, yeah, he was in it. But, um, that's just, you can't really stop insides, but it's just really scummy. And I mean, especially coming from a decent size or a big YouTuber, Strix, that's really scummy for Strix to inside people, but it's whatever. Uh, John the Boat, he was not a part of the uh, nude thing. He did inside her though, but he was not involved in the scam or anything. He cleared it up actually, and he gave me the important information that I needed to know so I didn't upload a fake video <laughs> like Goldfish. I didn't want to be a part of that. I, I try and keep my videos pretty factual. If, and I try and cover both sides of what's going on, but a lot of the wars are kind of one-sided. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it and have a great day.